valley treasure. You know the song, Tis So Sweet to Trust in Jesus? Tis so sweet to trust in Jesus. Just to take him. Just at his word. Just to rest upon his promise. Just to know the said the Lord Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Come on, sing it. How can you help me, Minister Brenda? How I prove him over and over. Jesus, Jesus, precious Jesus. Oh, for grace. Trust him more. Come on, sing it again. Tis so sweet. Tis so sweet. My God. To trust in Jesus. Hallelujah. Just to take him at his word. Just to rest. Just to rest. Come on, lift your hands to heaven, church. Just to know. Just to know that he is Lord. Jesus, Jesus. Jesus, Jesus, how I trust Come on, just lift your hands to heaven, church. Trust him more. Sing it one more time. Jesus, Jesus. Jesus, Jesus. How I trust you. How I approve you over and over. Over and over and over and over in Jesus. Yes, Lord. Jesus, oh, all for grace, oh, for grace, yes, Lord. oh, for grace, oh, oh, for grace to trust you more. He's an awesome God. Come on, somebody, put your hands together. Give him a praise here. He wants you to trust him, church. He's teaching you to trust him in the midst of the storm. He's teaching you to trust him. He said, Lord Jesus. Come on, just close your eyes. Forget about everyone around you. Lift your hands to heaven. Say, Lord Jesus, I'm going to trust you in the midst of the storm. Say, Lord Jesus, I surrender. Not my will. Not my will, Lord Jesus. Your will be done. Just before we close this service here. Maybe there's someone in this house. You haven't yet surrendered your life to the Lord Jesus Christ. You're not saved. You're not born again you are in this service and the spirit of God has touched your heart Pastor Sean I don't know Jesus I want to trust him I want to give my life to the Lord Jesus the Bible says in John 6 37 he says anyone that comes to him he will in no way turn you away he loves you beyond measure He died on Calvary's cross, 
shed his precious blood that we might receive forgiveness of sins if I'm talking to you if your heart's not right with God I want you to come and meet me at this altar if the Holy Spirit is tugging at your heart I'm giving you a chance to come and accept this Jesus that I just preached about he's absolutely awesome If you're not a Christian, I'm opening the doors for you to come and meet my Jesus. He's awesome. If you don't know Jesus, raise your hands to heaven. If you're not a Christian, just raise your hands to heaven. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Somebody put your hands together and give God a praise. People, put your trust in God. Are you listening to me, church? Put your trust in God. Remember when Jesus was in the Garden of Gethsemane? The Bible says he went to his disciples about two or three times and he found them asleep. There's some stuff, I don't care who's next to you. There's some stuff God designed for you to deal with. You're going to have to wrestle that out in prayer all by yourself. But the Bible says the last time when Jesus came to his disciples, Pastor Murphy, he said, sleep on. What, what happened to Jesus? Why, why did he come back and tell his disciples, sleep on? Because Jesus realized there is some things only God can help me get through it. I said there are some things that only God can help you get through it. But I want you to know it's going